Okay, who doesn't love a little champagne? Hello everyone and welcome back. Thanks so much for tuning into my channel. So today we're going to be exploring the fragrance Le Bubbly by Juicy Couture. Now, this is one that is a part of the Viva La Juicy line, which I have explored a few of. And yeah, a little while back, I did venture out on a birthday adventure and I did pick up a sample of this fragrance as well as Pink Couture. So I will link my birthday adventure down below and as well my review of Pink Couture in case you're interested in checking that out later. Anyways, on to the fragrance Le Bubbly. So I do have it right here. There we go. And yeah, let's check it out inside. So yeah, you know, this is one that I have to say really embodies its name. Um, one spritz of this has you thinking of bubbly pink champagne parties and fun. It really is a party in a bottle, guys. Honestly, it really is. It's a lot of fun. And yeah, I would say, you know what? Try it and pop open that glam girls. Okay guys, so a little bit of background about this fragrance. But before we get to that, here is how the bottle does look. So there you go. Um, now this is a fragrance for ladies. Um, it is a floral fruity. Uh, gourmand and as well it was launched in 2020. Um, some first impressions of this scent. Um, I would say you know it opens up with a bubbly sparkling champagne, um, a juicy orange and as well berries. Um, from there you get this really nice jasmine, uh, praline and vanilla that come through and as well gardenia. And yeah, then the dry down is basically nice woody notes. Um, yeah, I would say, you know, this is a sweet fragrance, but it is balanced out very well with the gardenia, jasmine, praline. Um, yeah, and as well the woody notes, which really kind of tones it down slightly. But yes, I really do feel like the best way to describe the vibe of this scent is fruit dipped in sparkling champagne. Mmm. <laughs> it really has that sort of vibe to it. And yeah, I also did find that, you know, compared to the other um, Viva La Juicy fragrances, it doesn't really have as much of that original DNA in it, which, you know, is kind of nice. It's kind of different. And yeah, I really did like that about it. And in terms of the sillage and longevity of this one, I would say it is pretty moderate. Um, and in terms of the personality of this fragrance, it is fun, feminine, dazzling, and bright. Um, yeah, really, really lots of fun. And yeah, let's just quickly touch on the bottle, which is right there inside. Um, I love the bottle. You know, it's got that pink bling going on, the bubbles on the bottom, the pink bow. Yeah, I mean, it's just, it's so much fun, right? And, you know, I really do love the Juicy Couture bottles because I feel like, you know, they're so whimsical. They're full of so much character and they're really just, you know, bottles that look so cute on a vanity or a dresser. All right, so when would you wear a fragrance like this? Um, well, I would say this is good pretty much year round. Um, maybe, you know, in the summer, it might be a little more sweet, but I think you can still get away with it. Um, but yeah, I would say this is great for, you know, bachelorettes, birthday parties for sure, um, going out clubbing, um, yeah, any parties, dates, meeting for cocktails, but yeah, anything that really just has a fun vibe to it, definitely a party vibe. And yeah, in terms of style and accessories, 
You know, I want to say once again that pink is definitely a great color to accessorize with this fragrance. Um, and, you know, in terms of actual outfits, party dresses all the way. Uh, I think it's right in the name, you know, La Bubbly. Obviously, the theme is all about having fun and celebrating. So yeah, party dresses. I would even say, you know, even a fun party type of top. Um, and in terms of materials, you know, obviously, I would say sequins goes well with this. Um, silk, you know, any of those party type of materials. And yeah, I would definitely accessorize this one. I would wear the chandelier earrings, you know, lots of bling. Yeah, really play it up and have a lot of fun. Anyways, guys, that pretty much sums it up for La Bubbly. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this review helped. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And you can always check out my page, which I will link down below. Thanks so much, guys. Happy spritzing and happy styling.